How dark is the ocean? Imagine stepping into the darkest place you can think of. Perhaps it's a moonless night in a dense forest, where the only light comes from distant stars. Now, multiply that darkness a thousandfold, and you might come close to the depths of the ocean. In the abyssal depths, sunlight diminishes, leaving an environment that can only be described as an eternal night. It's a stark contrast to the bustling, well-lit world we're accustomed to. But just how dark is the ocean? Researchers have discovered that beyond a depth of around 200 meters, sunlight becomes increasingly scarce. At these depths, less than 1% of surface sunlight reaches the ocean, leaving an almost complete absence of light. The darkness is so intense that it engulfs everything in its path, creating an otherworldly environment. In this realm of perpetual darkness, you might wonder if anything can survive. Remarkably, there are organisms that have adapted to this extreme environment. Deep-sea creatures have evolved incredible strategies to navigate, communicate, and find food without the aid of sunlight like the. One of the fascinating adaptations is bioluminescence, the ability to produce light through chemical reactions within their bodies. Many deep-sea organisms, such as anglerfish and certain types of jellyfish, use bioluminescent displays to attract prey, communicate, or even find mates. This natural light show brings a glimmer of illumination to the dark abyss. Additionally, some deep-sea creatures possess large eyes, highly sensitive to even the faintest traces of light. These eyes help them detect bioluminescent signals or any available ambient light, giving them a slight advantage in this perpetually dark world. Darkness is a favor places of giant creatures like the colossal squid, the largest known invertebrate on Earth. With eyes the size of dinner plates and tentacles that can reach over 10 meters in length, this enigmatic creature haunts the darkness of the deep sea. Little is known about its behavior and lifestyle, adding to its mysterious allure. Another massive resident of the ocean depths is the aptly named deep sea hatchetfish. While small in size, these slender fish have elongated bodies and distinctive hatchet-shaped silhouettes. They have adapted to the darkness by possessing specialized light-producing organs called photophores, which help camouflage them from potential predators below while emitting a faint glow from above. The ocean depths also harbor colossal jellyfish species, such as the lion's mane jellyfish. With tentacles that can extend for over 30 meters and a bell measuring several meters in diameter. These giants of the deep sea captivate the imagination. They drift through the darkness, their bioluminescent glow mesmerizing both prey and observers alike. The pressure of the deep sea depths adds an additional layer of intensity to the experience. Descending thousands of meters below the surface, the weight of the water above creates an immense pressure that can be unfathomable to us. Yet, these deep sea organisms have adapted to withstand these extreme conditions. Now, let's imagine diving into the deepest parts of the ocean, where sunlight cannot reach. It's a sensory experience unlike anything you know. The darkness is absolute, a blanket of blackness that engulfs you. You rely on other senses, such as touch and hearing, to navigate and understand your surroundings. Can you imagine how dark and cold it is? How would you feel if you are alone in that darkness? Would you feel desperate? I believe that is definitely a terrible experience and you might undergo thalassophobia afterward. In the dark depths of the ocean, we are mere visitors, briefly touching the edges of a mysterious world that thrives in the absence of light. It's a humbling reminder of the incredible diversity and adaptability of life on our planet. The depths remain a realm of wonder and curiosity, waiting for future explorations to reveal more of its secrets. However, be careful with the ocean as we might encounter unexpected dangers in that deep blue.